Mom's busy getting all worked up, Eden. We're not going to let her out of the house with any of this stuff. Hello? Kelly? Oh, don't tell me. Gina's spoils, I'll bet. I wouldn't bet on it if I were you. It's going right back where it came from. She's not even trying to take it out the back door, is she? Well, got hooks, though. She's a thief. What are you doing? Doing exactly what my father told me to do. Make sure you don't rob the place on your way out. Everything that is here is mine. No, it is not. You've practically looted the place. Your father has given me things that you don't even know my about. My father said you take nothing that you don't come with. What about my trousseau? What about the things he told me I could buy? What is that? Give that to me. Yeah, that's mine. No, give it to me. Lady that's out, mine. Lady. Let me have it. Lady. I gave you a chance to leave with dignity. Eden decides what you take. And if you give us any more trouble, I will have the police escort you out. All right. You want everything I own, is that it? Well, you can have it. You can have everything you can have it. Oh. But what are you waiting for, girl? Those are your father's precious pearls on the floor. Don't you think you should drop down your hands and knees and crawl around and see if you can pick them up? You should have this. You can have that because I don't want any of it. I don't want anything that reminds me of this house. Gina, didn't you buy that dress in Paris when Dad was still in his coma? Well, I guess you're right. I guess I can't wear this. I can't wear anything I've, I've gotten with a dirty cap of money. Well, that's fine, because you can have this. And you can have this. And this. And this. Now you have everything. Everything except for me and my son. And you're going to wish that you had given me what I wanted in the first place. Because it's going to be a lot less than what I'm going to take from you now. I'm going to take everything any of you have ever loved. You hear me, CC? Well, Sophia. Hi. Come on in. You won't believe what you just missed. And we forgot to take snapshots. You can't believe it. She really did that? Mm -hmm. Think she made her do that? Naked as a jaybird. Yeah, she uh, went a little berserk. A little? <laughs> we saw a side of her we'd never seen before. <laughs> Several, actually. A front hey, side, a back side. Can you cut the humor, please. Oh, good baby, still here. Mom? Hi, Annie. Uh, Daddy is coming back down. He has something very important he wants to say to all of us. Uh-oh, about me? He didn't say. Mm, now that he's disposed of Gene, I'm sure I'm next. Ah, reinforcements. I'll get that. Well, if it isn't the cavalry coming over the hill. Mason, I want to have a talk with your father. You're the only one who wants to. Come on in. Bruce, I don't think he's ready to see you. And I'm afraid I'm going to have to insist. All right, Eden. You can send him up. I would hazard that it's to ask about the attempt on Dad's life. Am I right, Cruz? <clears throat> oh, I'd sure like to be a fly on that wall, wouldn't you, Eden? Eden! Honey, is your father in there alone? I have to go in there and talk to him. I know. Cruz is still with us. What's the matter? What happened? Nothing. Mama, I wish you were leaving. So do I, baby. So do I. Santana! Santana, no, you can't go in there. Hey, 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 no, I'm sorry for interrupting you, Cece, but I've waited long enough. I tried to stop her, Daddy. I did. I have to talk to you about Brandon. This is not the time, Santana. That is right, Santana. He gave me his word, and now he's going back No, on... I didn't. I said I would take care of the boy, not give you custody. You're not taking care of him. You're letting Gina take him. Gina is attached to him. The boy only knows Gina as his mother. He's my son, not hers, and I want him. I'm sorry. You're sorry? This is his life we're talking about. If she's not good enough to be your wife, what makes you think she's good enough to raise my son? No, Cece. He thinks of you as his father. Please, I beg you. Even though Channing is not your son, you raised him and you loved him even more than your own children. This is his little boy. 
What does he mean even less to you now? Now that you found out that Channing was the son of a circus performer. That can't kind of stop it. That has nothing to do with anything. Talking about Daddy, Mama, he was with Lionel and your son. Santana. See, see, they have to learn sometime. Circus performer? Well, this is not exactly the time I would have picked. But I imagine you'll have to all know soon enough. The boy known as Brick Wallace is the son of Lionel and Sophia. Lionel and your mother. Thanks, oh, Lockridge. Switched the boys soon after birth with the Wallace baby who was born in the same hospital. She knew that Lionel was the father of Sophia's child and wanted to make sure that her grandson did not grow up to be a Capwell. Daddy, what you're saying is that we have a half-brother. Mama, is that right? Yes. Brick came to me and told me. Somehow he found out. Brick Wallace? Yes. Has the world gone mad? Hey, what are you doing here? I told you to get off my property. I want to talk to you for a few minutes. It won't take long. You could have left these downstairs. You never bend, do you? I ordered you off my estate. I'm leaving. I don't want you ever to come back to this house. My children live in this house. Not all of them. Not Brick. I suggest you visit with him quite a bit, because you're not welcome back here. How long, C.C., do I do penance? Till you go to hell. Oh, this is a waste of time. I only came back to say goodbye to my children. They are not children anymore. They're adults, and they don't need you. They love me, C.C., and I don't care how you feel about me, because nothing... Nothing is going to stop me from seeing Eden or Ted or Kelly. Or Brick. Or Brick. Goodbye. Where will you go? I don't know. I haven't thought about it. Little Lionel, I suppose. I haven't decided, Cece. I'm surprised you care. Don't confuse curiosity with concern. I am not the least bit concerned. Mom, I didn't know you were in here. It's all right. I was just leaving. I can't stay here long. I'm giving your father back the keys. I'll miss you. We all will. I'll miss you too, baby, but I want you to know that I am not going to be far from any of you ever. Goodbye, baby. Congratulations. You know, don't you? You know who I am. They know. Well. Never have so many had so little to say. Who'll be first? Ted? Eden? Stay here and talk to me. Uh, no, I don't. I don't think so. Please don't go. No, I'm, I'm sorry. No. Uh, Kelly, here are the uh, figures that you wanted. Do uh, you mind if we talk tomorrow? What figures? Uh, the, the ones that you wanted to see. I don't know what you're talking about, Brick. Well, Mason here called me and said that you wanted to see some of the... Uh, I never told Mason anything. Actually, Brick, I just thought we should all meet. Well, why didn't you just tell him that? So springing it on him like this. You're still here, Sophia? I thought I ordered you out of the Daddy, house. Daddy, do! What are you waiting for? Get out! Oh, wait a minute, no. Who are you talking to her like this, huh? It's all right. It's all right, Brick. Nothing okay. more touching than a son defending his mother. Why are you coming here? Get out and take your mother with you. you no, know, you're lucky I wasn't raised in this house. What are you looking for? What do you want from us? Oh, from me? Oh, Cece, so many questions. And for once, doesn't have all the answers, huh? What do you want, and what are you asking? 
Don't worry. You're going to have to wait to get like that. Like everybody else! 